Hello, good morning. This is your daily outlook for Friday, the 25th of July. The euro continued the downtrend and reached a new eight month low at 134.37 against the US dollar. The single currency rebounded up to 134.84 after better than expected German flash manufacturing and flash services data. The single currency is now trading at around 134.67, while the German IFO business climate is on the calendar for today. The US dollar rose yesterday against the Japanese yen towards 101.76. The greenback gained after the low US unemployment claims set to be the lowest in the last eight years, which is another sign that the US labour market is recovering. Looking at equities, the European equities gained yesterday as the European manufacturing and services indicators showed higher than expected. The JER 30 advanced to 9.783, the France 40 went to 4.400 and the Swiss to 8.631. Looking at commodities, soybeans dropped from a one-week high at $12.31 back to $12 a bushel as global supply seems to be increasing. And our mover and shaker today is gold. Gold continues its bearish trend as yesterday it fell another $15 and reaching a one-month low at $1,287 an ounce. The demand for the precious metal has been decreased as the outlook for economic growth improved. Option traders may consider constructing a back spread strategy with puts on the gold dollar and gain if the pair moves lower, while the risk is limited to the premium paid. A back spread strategy with puts can be constructed by selling an at the money put while buying an out of the money put at double the amount. And watch out at 8GMT in Europe. We have the German IFO business climate expected at 109.60. At 8.30 GMT in the UK, we have the preliminary GDP quarter on quarter expected at 0.8%. And at 12.30 GMT in the US, we have the core durable goods orders month on month forecast to rise by 0.6%. Thank you for tuning in to our daily outlook. We look forward to seeing you again next week. I'm Amanda from the News Forest Dealing Room. Have a great weekend.